Hey everyone, this is Super Galactic, and I'd like to welcome y'all to my YouTube channel. And what I want to talk about is an interview that Ryder Lee did with Wayne Steiger and how they talked about a documentary that uh, Ryder Lee would like to do. And I really encouraged them to do this documentary because what they was talking about today in an interview was very interesting and it's a heed warning to every American in the United States to really pay attention to. And um, I highly recommend everybody to watch that interview because what Ryder Lee did was he shared with everybody that was listening to that interview a map of the United States and each light that lit up on the map of the United States on the years that UFO sightings had increased, it increased big time in the United States throughout the whole world. The United States are the ones with the most UFO sightings. Not to mention the Middle Eastern countries and Israel. Something's at foot here. Something just ain't right. And that's basically what Wayne Steiger said. Some, something ain't right. There's something going on. Here they got us afraid of ETs. Here they got us afraid of extraterrestrials. But it's not that. I think the big threat is AI. I've always believed that. I believe these craft that we see flying in the air. I believe they're they're used to keep track of people. I believe they're using AI sophisticated technology to keep track of people. We are an experiment. And they're keeping track of us. They're trying to figure what they possibly can out of us. These craft probably know what we do on our phone. These craft probably know what we do on the internet. They probably know all of that. Here you got this TikTok thing going on where they either want somebody to sell it to some kind of billionaire here in the United States and and I get the fact that we don't want people spying on us in everything that we do. We want people to stay out of our lives. I get that. I would want the same thing. But if you think they're going to stop doing that by just selling it to some billionaire here in the United States, if you really think that's all going to end, you're sadly mistaken. Because it'll just be the same old, same old thing. It'll just keep going on and on and on. This ain't going to change until the American people start hurting them financially. You know, a lot of people think, well, if I just go out there and protest on the streets, Maybe they'll pay attention to me. That ain't going to work. We've been doing that for, for years. What has that ever done? Absolutely nothing. I mean, folks, they don't pay attention to that. What they pay attention to is that money, that Judeo money magic system. That's what rules over them. Money is their God. And when you take their God from them, that's where you get them.
And that's what we got to do. We got to hurt them financially. We got to get them where it really hurts, and that's financially. We got to realize what the real problem is, and it's Christianity. It's Judeo Christianity. Judeo money magic system. They're the problem. And I'm not going to go into that because of where YouTube is, but you know the problem. You know what you got to do. You got to hurt these people financially. Because I would never wish violence or death on anybody. I don't care what religion. You belong to. My goal is to wake you up from that religion. Get you to turn from that religion. Get you to realize you've been indoctrinated all your life. You've been brainwashed all your life. And I'm just trying to lift the veils from your eyes to get you to see what's really going on. But I do. I wish... Wayne and Ryder Lee will get together and do this documentary. Show the American people and people all over the world if he decides to make it worldwide. Show people, especially here in America, that we're an experiment. That's the only way I can see it. The United States, Israel, the Middle Eastern countries, we're an experiment. It's like Wayne said, it's a takeover. That's all it is. It's a takeover. And who's trying to take over us? It's a virus. An AI virus. That's probably one day pushing the you know what thing. Because that's their way of keeping track of us. And that's the reason why I really recommend people to take nanosoma. Cause it will, it'll, it'll be the best thing we got to take care of that. I take it all the time. Cause I know how crucial it is for me to take that. But, and I look for nanosoma to end up becoming more popular when people start waking up. That's the reason why I really hope. That Ryder Lee and Wayne Steyer will get together and do this documentary. Because this documentary is something that needs to be done. This could be the very thing to really shift people's paradigm. Even for the Christians. Even these hardcore Christians that are so hardcore Christian-like and swear by that Bible. This could very well wake them up. This could wake Stu Peters up. This could wake E. Michael Jones up. And I'm just being hopeful. That's, that's just me. I'm going to try to be hopeful and optimistic about the future and just hope that a documentary like that could wake them up. That's just me being hopeful. But also know we got to watch out for people because there's a lot of people that don't have our best interests. They will stab us in the back if we're not careful. We can be too trustworthy and they can use that for weakness. And, and we got to be mindful of that. So I'm just trying to be hopeful and be optimistic and Hopefully more and more people wake up. Because I don't want people misled. I don't want people taking the wrong path. I want people to trust their in instincts, their intuition, and just go with your gut. Because when you feel something that's not right, and stuff just don't add up, and you feel that in your blink, trust that. But you feel that for a reason. That's that's your intuition warning you about things. When you're around somebody or you know somebody 
and there's something not quite right about them and you you know it's a warning you trust that you feel that for a reason that's something you should never ignore because when you ignore it like that and you just brush it off the side like it's no big deal that can get you in some trouble in life so always pay attention to that and that's what i say about right of the end Wayne Steiger, if you feel deep in your gut that this documentary is very important and that it needs to be made, you trust that and you follow that. You know, you do what you think is right, Wayne. You do what you think is right, right of you. If you feel like this documentary will be powerful and that it will wake up people, you go with that gut feeling because you will feel that for a reason. Don't ever ignore that. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Leave a comment in the comment section below and tell me what you think. And please hit the bell so you'll be notified whenever I make another video. And y'all please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And all of y'all have a good one.